The welcome screen gives you three options for starting a game within SimVenture. A new game represents a startup situation, so the business hasn't even begun to trade yet. Settings can be adjusted to vary the degree of challenge you'll face. So you can make things fairly easy for yourself initially, and then take on more challenges as you gain experience. Once you confirm your settings, the simulation creates a unique set of data to represent the virtual market that you will work in. So every new game needs thorough analysis to ensure success. The scenario briefing gives more details about the starting position of the business, and an advisor report gives you some guidance on how to get the business off the ground. From then on in, you'll be given some advice as you progress, but success or failure will be down to the quality of your decision making. Your second option on the welcome screen is to load a saved game. SimVenture games are saved as folders, each containing a number of files to store the current data for that game. So when you reload the game, you can continue from where you left off. Lastly, you can load one of the scenarios created by the SimVenture team for a specific purpose. The apprentice scenarios are designed to help new users learn the basics of getting a virtual business started. The scenarios provide a little bit of extra guidance on some key principles, and we recommend that you try these before diving into a simulation. The driving lesson scenario also provides a good environment in which to learn about SimVenture. It features an already successful business that you can use to try things out and get to know your way around the software. Other scenarios focus on specific business issues and are set in the higher levels of SimVenture. Whilst we wouldn't recommend you start with these, you might want to take on the challenge once you've gained some experience. You can restart any scenario as many times as you like, and because the starting point is always the same, it's easy to learn from your previous mistakes.